are you looking for? 10 Best Things to Do in Annapolis Annapolis is a combination of ancient old sites and water-fueled sports. For instance, with Inside the Identical Day, you may excursion the 19th century St. Anne's Church, take a cruising lesson, evaluate yachts on Ego Alley, and chow down on steamed crabs at any quantity of vicinity eating places. Simply meandering the splendidly preserved historic Annapolis is every other famous pastime. Here is the list of 10 best things to do in Annapolis. 1. United States Naval Academy The United States Naval Academy campus is stunning and will pay homage to the Naval Department of the Military, even even as it increases up the brand new generation. The midday meal formation, wherein the midshipmen march in formation, is a must-see as properly, and it is held climate permitting. In the unfastened U.S. Naval Academy Museum, you may take a self-guided excursion through the Navy's records, but latest traffic rather advise taking gain of the guided on-foot excursion of the campus. Now no longer handiest will you benefit perception into naval records, however you may additionally study the Academy's bow art structure and landscaping. The Naval Academy is likewise regarded for its tune department. Throughout the year, a couple of choral and instrumental ensembles, consisting of the Naval Academy Band, placed on performances which are open to the general public. Masks are required for all of us who attends a performance. Proof of vaccination or a terrible PCR COVID check no older than 72 hours is likewise required to attend. Check the internet site earlier than your go-to to buy tickets. 2. Historic Annapolis What traffic commonly talk over with is historic Annapolis is the abundance of eating places, galleries, and stores that fill the transformed row homes on Main Street. You'll discover the whole lot from eating places along with the famous Chick and Ruth's to boutiques like Lilac Biju. On a pleasing day, this row of stores is a pleasing area to meander for some hours. However, you ought to additionally understand that the ancient vicinity additionally formally extends to maximum of downtown and the harbor, which incorporate jewels just like the Hammond Harwood House and the Banneker Douglas Museum. Recent tourists stated a go-to right here is a pleasing manner to spend a fab fall afternoon. If you are driving, traffic counsel leaving your vehicle out of doors the ancient old district to keep away from the irritating road parking. Several close-by garages provide an area to park your car even as you explore. 3. Banneker Douglas Museum Although the Banneker Douglas Museum is small, it is loaded with records. It's named for the black scientist Benjamin Banneker and black social crusader Frederick Douglas. Both of those guys have been concerned with the combat towards slavery with inside the 19th century, and the museum does an awesome process telling their memories. The museum is housed with inside the former Mount Moriah African Methodist Episcopal Church, which become indexed at the National Register of Historic Places in 1973. Recent traffic to the museum stated it affords a properly curated assessment of African American records in Maryland and the team of workers is greater than satisfied to inform the memories of lesser regarded figures who motivated the Annapolis and Baltimore communities. 4. Quiet Waters Park If you are trying to stretch your legs in a picturesque area, Quiet Waters Park is the area to do it. Its 340 acres incorporate the whole lot from an about 7-mile paved path, ideal for motor motorcycle rides or jogs, to formal gardens perfect for a walk. You'll additionally discover plenty of sculptures and artwork galleries in an effort to attraction to artwork lovers, in addition to a playground, wherein kids can work out their wiggles. In the summertime, there are outside concert events and canoes and kayaks to rent, and with inside the iciness, an ice rink appears. The park's South River Overlook is every other favorite spot because it gives a wide-ranging view of the South River. Annapolis locals say the Canine Park is the correct area to carry your four-legged friend and the vicinity gives a big choice of sports and wooded trails for all forms of tourists to explore. 5. Ego Alley Ego Alley isn't always an alley with inside the conventional feel of the word. In place of a walkway, it is a slender waterway that spills out into Spa Creek. The name Ego Alley comes from the queue of high-priced boats that parade through the waterway on evenings and weekends, but it does make for a thrilling area to meander. Recent traffic defined it as a must-see. The benches alongside Dock Street are the correct area to sit, loosen up, and watch the boats, and those cross with the aid of using. In heat climate, many human beings order an ice cream cone from the close-by Storm Bros. Ice Cream Factory earlier than finding out the boats. During the iciness excursion season, 11 though cold, is every other high-quality time to take a walk down right here considering the various boats are decked out in Christmas lights. 6. Hammond Harwood House The Hammond Harwood House, the self-proclaimed jewel of Annapolis, is in all seriousness, a gem. William Buckland, the indentured servant became famed architect additionally chargeable for George Mason's Gunston Hall, 
started paintings at the townhouse with inside the overdue 18th century. He hired factors of the Anglo-Palladian style that have been masterfully preserved. Visitors to the house will experience 60-minute guided excursions that contact on the whole lot from the structure to the households that inhabited the house. A hour, $20 in intensity excursion of the structure of the residence is likewise provided with the aid of using appointment handiest. Short on time, consider the 30-minute excursion that explores the principal residence, and an abbreviated records. Special hobby excursions also are to be had on rotating schedules. Tour subjects consist of clocks and Jane Austen. Recent traffic to the residence stated they have been pleasantly amazed with the aid of using how thrilling the excursion become, including that the courses are informed and do a first-rate process enticing traffic and soliciting questions. 7. Maryland State House Even 11 though the Maryland State House does not have a tendency to wow traffic with its structure or exhibits, it's far the web page of illustrious records. In fact, it is soon as served because the capital of the U.S. for a brief stint and it stays the oldest kingdom residence this is nevertheless in legislative use, and the grounds are pretty cute as properly. Several latest tourists determined the Maryland State House to be a thrilling stroll through U.S. records, noting that the constructing is relatively small, and surfing its rooms, and halls failed to take too long. In brief, when you have an hour to kill, the Maryland State House is a worth area to spend it. 8. William Parker House and Garden the pristine William Parker House and Garden is an immaculately restored 18th century Georgian mansion, and it became the house of a younger lawyer, William Parker, who sooner or later have become one of the signers of the Declaration of Independence and the Governor of Maryland. Along with the excursion of the residents, traffic ought to make time to wander across the cautiously manicured two-acre garden. Recent visitors agreed that team of workers and excursion courses have been great and informative and greater than inclined to reply questions on the residents and grounds. 9. Sandy Point State Park When Sandy Point State Park opened in 1952, it become the handiest kingdom park that African Americans have been allowed to go to. Although the park become integrated, the general public centers have been nevertheless segregated, stemming from the Brown v. Board of Education decision. The NAACP filed a lawsuit in 1954 to desegregate the park, and the U.S. Supreme Court ordered the combination of the park in 1955, enriched in Maryland records. And herbal beauty, Sandy Point State Park is a great area to go to if you are seeking out an outside day trip. The 786-acre park is placed at the northwestern shore of the Chesapeake Bay in Annapolis. Not handiest can traffic partake with inside the seashores and picnic areas, however they also can experience different outside sports along with fishing, crabbing, and swimming. Adjacent to the park is the Corcoran Tract, that's a four-mile path with inside the Corcoran Environmental Study Area wherein tourists can hike, jog and sightsee. 10. Thomas Point Shoal Lighthouse Thomas Point Shoal Lighthouse dates returned to 1824 whilst Congress appropriated $6,500 for the development of a 30-feet, land primarily based totally tower. It was until November 1875 that the lighthouse became first lit. A hundred years later in 1975, the lighthouse became indexed at the National Register of Historic Places. It became man with the aid of using the Coast Guard till 1986 whilst it have become the closing lighthouse at the Chesapeake Bay to be absolutely automated. It is the handiest screw pile lighthouse with inside the Chesapeake Bay nevertheless in its authentic location. Today, the lighthouse is owned with the aid of using the city of Annapolis and controlled with the aid of using the U.S. Lighthouse Society. During the one half hour excursion visitors are taken return through time to the 1,800 seconds wherein they may study the records of the lighthouse, how the lighthouse keepers lived, the position the Coast Guard performed in lighthouse's lifetime and what is being carried out to repair and keep the lighthouse for the subsequent generation.